kidding me? I have to- Why does this keep happening? Every video, I just fail. Hey internet, it's Jessica and welcome back to GTA San Andreas in the last episode. We have been exiled. Sweet is in jail. Smoke betrayed us. Kendall's life may be in danger, but it seems like we may have gotten ourselves back to the city, but I don't really know what's going on now because Tenmenny has so many plans for us and just keeps screwing us over. So I don't know how much longer CJ can take of this. If you guys have been enjoying my GTA videos, remember to leave a like. Your support does help this channel. Let's me know you want more videos on San Andreas. So before we start the video, remember to leave a like on it. Mother, that mute tone, that snake without a tongue, gave me this hole instead of a pink slip. I, I must mean, be the biggest an idiot in the whole can, world. Can you sell oh, this place? Take it easy. At least we're alive. That's Girl, true too. Friend, fellow traveler, relax. I thought you man. were leaving. Really Why is he still here? <laughs> well, I'm sorry I'm up your vibe, old man, but I can't wait to get my hands on that mute and your <laughs> calendar ass says cup. STD. My cousin. You're gonna diss my familia? My bad, man. I'm just pissed for all of us. I mean, look, we in a strange place. We got to our name. And for once, I try to make something work this garage, and it ain't even a garage. Then make it into a garage. Right, so I'm complaining, oh, CJ. That's a great idea, sis. Won't you shut up? You know what, Carl? You are a Idiot. Your whole I agree with Kendall. For nothing. Now you've got something and you don't know what to do with it. We'll make it good enough. We'll help, right? We got your back, CJ. Come on, stop tripping, man. Both of you. Whoa, man, the energy here is fantastic. <laughs> oh. Okay. Sir, if you're not gonna help, could you yeah. please leave? Uh, all right. But how am I find some good mechanics to work up in here, man? I know a few guys. Come with me, friend. They're good people, I swear it. Oh, man, I'm about to ride with this fool again. <laughs> I mean, we can't really be uh, picky when it comes to help because man. there's these two guys I we know. got no Used choice. Work on marine engines till the mob bought their business over in Vice. Now they try and make ends meet by taking any old job. They're a little bit dull by their habit, but the smoke don't get in the way of their skills with an engine. We'll pick up Jethro first. Last I heard, he Jethro. was working in the garage over in East Basin. Okay. All right, let's go pick up Jethro. Hmm. Hey, man, how you meet these dudes anyway? I met them at the 89th year 11, apparently. Apparently? You don't remember. Is, man. Well, to be fair, he's always Field high, tanks, right? Crazy-ass music. A quart of mescaline vodka. Polar bears. Polar huh? Bears. Yeah, go figure. But they were funny guys, man. Great sense what do you mean of humor. polar bears? I'm so confused. Oh, I, I took a wrong turn. Hang on. This here's Vietnamese gang territory. Dang boys. Shiny oh. razors. Butterfly children. Watch yourself, dude. These cats are real serious. Okay. Hey, Jezreel. Is that him? Hop in, man. I've landed you a real job. Hey there, Truth, dude. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Do I owe you? Cause I swear I paid for that weed, dude. No man, um, we're good. I think. Jethro, Carl. Carl, Jethro. Hey, what's, what's up, up, Jethro? Man? Can we swing by the hospital? It's over in Santa Flora district. West of here. Yeah. You sick? No. The government is. But that's a long story. So you know, like what does what's that the mean? Deal, dudes? I'm opening the garage in Doherty by the waste ground. You know, car mods, low riders, all that. Damn, do polar bears in the woods? No, but they've been known to sh the liquor tent. That's that's what uh, yeah, CJ that always like, says to Carlos. So far gone. I can't drive. <laughs> what we here for anyway? Nothing. Huh? Oh, what don't do you mean nothing. Cover your faces. Think about a yellow rubber duck. You what is happening? Shh. Who the hell is that? Okay, I've seen enough. Let's go see if we can find Wayne. He's working a hot dog what? van, tram terminal, and Kings. 
Come on, okay, dude. Okay, let's go get Dwayne. It. You don't want to know. What? I, do, I kind of do want to know. Where the phone is. A what? Exactly. Sometimes it's best to stay in the dark, kid. I, I guess? Is that him? Dude, Dwayne, man, how's the hot dog? Why was he holding a joint like this? <laughs> totally. Why? What's happening? Uh, my friend Carl here is opening a chop shop. Jethro's in. How about you? Uh, yeah, cool, man. Uh, I've got like some to take care of first, though. So, uh, you tell me where you guys are gonna be at, and I'll meet you dudes there. The garage is on the waste grounds in Doherty. Our all right. employee is gonna be dope heads. Oh my god! I mean, like I okay. said, we can't really Next be stop, picky with downtown. who we're working with. We what? need all the help Watch we can get. Why? If I told you, the likelihood is you'd get a probe up your ass within a month. Like, listen to the man. What? Dude. He's real serious about that. Well, uh, okay, but you're starting to freak me out with all that space, man. Oh my god. Okay, whatever. Okay, you know the drill. What, don't, don't look, look interested in anything. We look suspicious. There's Picture another a van. Good golf ball in your mind. Okay, we're good to go. Where to next, spacehead? This <laughs> electronics guy I've had dealings with goes by the name of Zero. He could fix a supercomputer with a paperclip. He's got his uh, own shop. All right. But he's always ready to help fellow travelers along the path. Let's go introduce you to him. Look, what's going on, True? Who was him do? Don't go there, man. Listen to Jethro. Now, what if I told you we never went to the moon? JFK oh lives in Scotland God. with Janis Joplin. And the only reason we've been in a Cold War for the last 45 years was <laughs> Yo, because Yo, please the stop talking. The oil business. I think you popped another micro dot. Good. Keep it that way. Let me, let me guess. He's, like, he's gonna say he's a flat earther next. Leave me alone, Berkeley. This is oh. stalking. Oh, hey, Truth. Get in. I'll fill you in as we drive. Home, James. Carl, zero. Zero, Carl. Hey, what's up, Carl dude? Carl here is opening a garage around the corner. I told him you're the man to speak to when it comes to electronics. <laughs> Actually, I'm the only man to speak to. <laughs> Grade A tip-top genius. That's me. Okay, that's nice. You should drop by the shop sometime. See some of my sh bro. I'll do that. I'm just taking a shortcut, everybody. Okay, we here. I like how the cutscene crashed as well. <laughs> we can hard work, and we'll transform this place. Hey, Caesar, come over here. What's up, B? Caesar, this Jethro, Dwayne, and Zero. Hey, man, dude. Salutations, my sibling. <laughs> hey, hey, Carl, look. I think I found a way for us to get paid. I ain't going to no college to study no account. No, idiot property. That hey. ain't exactly my thing either. No, Carl, would you listen to your sister? You buy a dump like this, fix it up, and sell it. Or better yet, you turn the property into a business. The snowball gets bigger. I don't know, sis. This all sound big time to me. Look, Carl, this place is going to get on its feet. And when it does, we are going to have money. If you want to make something of yourself, you got to let your money work for you. It's true. Look, I wouldn't even know what to store. Look, you two concentrate on the garage and let me work the property thing, okay? Okay. Yeah, that's my baby girl right there, homie. <laughs> Man, you chose her. I'm stuck with her. <laughs> Carl, how's San Fierro? It's Who's that? Up. I can honestly say I wish... Is that Ten Penny? Great. Now you got the present for that friend of mine, yeah. right? You know the one trying to get me and old Officer Pulaski into trouble? Yeah. Why don't you put that up in his car and give WeTip a call? Hey, mother the code of the streets is that I don't snitch. I don't give a we fuck if it snitch, kills you, though. me, my brother. Street cats don't call no cops. Carl, he's a DA. Oh, yeah? <laughs> well, <that's laughs> no fun. He's at the Van Kampf Hotel in the financial. Well, oh, how do you sure. know he's not lying, though? Wait a second. I know I know. he said he's not a cop, but it's Tenpenny. The DA is on his way to Van Kampf Hotel in downtown San Fierro. Get over there now. I need a car. The hotel operates a valet service. The DA will be dropping off his car here shortly. That means I gotta disguise myself as one of them. Oh, okay. Follow the valet under car. Waste him. Make sure 
No one is around. Okay, this poor man. He's just doing his job, but I'm gonna have to murder him for his outfit. <laughs> Dude, you're doing a terrible parking job. I'm Delhi. Hey! Oh shit. I'm a man of peace, baby. Alright. <laughs> That was close. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I totally. <laughs> CJ looks so stupid. Ah, you must be the new boy. Get in line. Uh, yes, that's me, new boy. <laughs> the DA is driving to Blue Marriott. Remember it. You'll need to identify it correctly. Make sure none of the other valley services has its car first. Okay, so this one. It's like a like a grayish car. I don't know what kind of car it is because I don't know cars. <laughs> Alright, identify and enter the DA's car when he arrives. Oh god, okay. So how long have you been working here, Bill? Damn! Wait, is this him? Hey, Parker. Wait, is this him? It kind of looks green now. I'm not sure. Wait. Hey, what's up? Excuse me, pal. I love a good Cluck and Bell burger, don't you? Yeah. I don't know if this is his car. I'm getting pa Yeah, it's pretty terrible. Bye now. Have a fun life. But okay. <laughs> You're in the DA's car. Get over to the garage where the drugs will be planted. Okay. I okay. I I <laughs> I guess it was just the lighting. It looked different. It's kind of green. I thought it was gray. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Alright, drugs are planted, let's go back. Oh fuck! Damn, those streetcars don't stop, huh? What the hell was that? Oh, are you serious? I have to fix the car too? Oh fuck! Damn it! <laughs> I guess that kind of makes sense. If we did damage the car, he would notice something's wrong. <laughs> okay, I have to drive carefully when I go back. Alright, trying to actually drive like... So, I'm actually gonna have to play right now how I used to play when I was 8 years old playing GTA 3 in front of my dad. <laughs> if you guys missed that part in the first video, I told this story that... I, the reason why I never played San Andreas is because I got banned from playing Grand Theft Auto at my house because my dad saw me playing GTA 3. And the main reason I really liked playing GTA 3 was because I liked to drive around. But I was like driving around normally, like I wasn't even breaking the rules, like I would stop at stoplights and stuff like that. Um, but I drove into a neighborhood where a shootout was happening. And my dad was behind me watching it, and uh, as soon as he saw that, he told me to immediately turn off and never play it again. Because when he asked me what kind of game it was, I told him, oh, you just drive around. I didn't tell him what kind of game it was, so I lied. What? Are you kidding me? I have to- Why does this keep happening? Every video, I just fail. Alright, I- Oh my god, I have to be careful. Don't damage the fucking car. Alright, get outside in the valley and then call the cops. Gotcha. Hello? Hello? This wee tip? I seen something highly suspicious you should come check out. <laughs> Police, don't move! Get out of the car with your hands in the air! Do you know who you're fucking with here? I'll have your badge, you moron! Shut up! You find anything back there? Found anything? He's got half of Mexico in here. Must be two tons of Mary here. Mm -hmm. What? But, but I've never seen. How could it be? Hell of a defense you got there, buddy! I guess <laughs> CJ just like casually like, yup, I did that. <laughs> Alright, ten penny better be happy.
Wait, what did that say? Enter the Market Valley Cardboard the Trigger. Oh, I can get Valley Mission now. Oh, hello? Yeah, what? Sorry, Carl, are you busy? Zero? Nah, man, good to hear from you. What's up? Disaster. My landlord is selling the shop. I'll have nowhere to live and no safe haven from Berkeley. Ah, uh, I'm wanna... looking to invest in some property at the moment. I was gonna say you Maybe wanna sit in the garage for a while. <laughs> uh, okay. What if I just? So many wasted lives. <laughs> I just stole that guy's car instead. Hey, homies. What up, Carl? What the is, um... is going on? Do I look like a hooker to you? What? The who said this to you? Got the structure workers up that here. I'm a fucker. Oh, up. shit. I got this. I need to go teach him a little respect. Is this uh, George respect. Lopez's theme song? <laughs> I've been thinking about getting me some new land anyway. What the F is that thing? Scare off the construction firm? Oh, it's a wrecking ball. I thought it was like some balloon. Destroy all the portables and kill the foreman. Oh yeah, on behalf of my sister, I have no problem with doing that. Construction machinery will help destroy portables. Okay. I'm gonna have to get rid of all of those people though. What if I just... Yup. I feel like this is the easiest way, in my opinion. <laughs> oh, fuck! This guy really coming at me with a shovel! Okay. I'm gonna have to, like, get the guy in the bulldozer, though. Okay, got you. Where is he? Go ahead, make me hurt. You want this to get ugly? Don't blame me, blame society. Am I hitting him? Uh, just <laughs> I gotcha. Where's the other guy? Bring it on, buddy. Oh, he's right there. Um. Want me to shoot as well. I feel like it's unnecessary to do all that, but I'm just gonna do it anyway. All right. Uh, oh, there's a timer, dude. Why do I keep saying I don't notice the timers? I keep doing that. Okay. What else? What else? Oh, the, the, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right. All right. Move, bitch! Be careful of the... Uh, what's it called? The barrels, too. Oh my god, come on, 50 seconds! OH SHIT! What the fuck? Why'd he go back in there? Push the mobile toilet into the ditch. Am I dead? Oh, bury him under concrete? Shit! I mean, I get it's for his sister, so like, I understand. Um, we're still alive. That's okay. Oh, what the fuck? Fuck off, dude. Okay, I have to push him in here? Oh god, no! Hang on, oh, there. Oh god, oh, I'm gonna Oh no, okay, hang on, I gotta get rid of these guys. I didn't know construction workers carried guns, is that normal? 
beat this guy's ass. Where is he? You won't be needing this now. What you saying? I think they keep spawning. I don't think it matters. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. Wait, will it work if I get like a different cement truck? Dude, I'm such a fucking idiot. Get out of the way. <laughs> Alright, let's try this one. I'm sure we'll still bury him, right? Because like, this is another cement truck. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> All right. Damn, this is kind of brutal, though. We're actually killing somebody like this? What in the Breaking Bad at the moment? All right, I have to talk to Zero. Where is he? Hello? Yeah, what? Yo, man. It's Jethro, dude. Hey, Jethro, what up? Well, I was talking to Caesar, and, uh, well, don't get me wrong, dude. I mean, you are one out there dude when it comes to driving, man. But Caesar, he told us how many cars you get through, dude. And me and Dwayne were like, whoa! Uh, okay, what get to the point. point. <laughs> no, no point, man, no point. Just that there's an advanced driving school, like, just up the road from the garage, man. Like in Doherty. Driving school? Man, exactly what you trying to say, man. <laughs> you're talking about my driving! Oh, damn, someone died. Cool and shit. I better go, CJ. Is that a cop? Uh, okay. I don't know what the point of telling me that was, but uh, alright. Buy this property? I mean, that go there goes all my money, but if it's gonna help Zero in our, our whole cause, yeah, I guess it's okay. You wasn't around when I signed the deeds. Yes, I know. I was on a dangerous reconnaissance mission. Deep into enemy territory. Uh, yeah, right, sure. Whatever you say. I should come through and have a look at the business, you know? Oh, of course, of course. I'll have to tidy up a bit. This place is such a mess. Don't worry about it. I'll drop in soon. What the hell is happening here? Wow, he's got a nice little shop. It's pretty impressive looking. Hey, what up, Z? Nothing is up, Carl, apart from my blood pressure and the imminent collapse of my hopes and dreams. You okay? Wow. As usual, the forces of darkness have triumphed over good. I like Life how he's, it's got Vice City on there. That's cool. Dispersed with agony. Homie, what you own? Whatever it is, you need to reduce the dosage. Excuse me, but I never take drugs. We all know drugs are for losers and or sex maniacs. And right now, sex is the last thing on my mind. God for that. Berkeley is back. Berkeley? Oh, Berkeley. Yes. Who the fuck is Berkeley? Oh, just a man I once beat in fair competition. A man- Oh, they got Vice City and Manhunt action oh, figures. Oh, you hands on him? No, please. <laughs> I never initiate violence. Oh, I know. You knocked this bitch. Uh, no. I won the prize in the science fair. <laughs> First prize, that is. Oh, congratulations. And now you want to pop you? <laughs> no. And they say gangbangers is petty as small-minded. 
the F is that? Hey, what's that bleeping sound? That's him. We shall fight to the end. What? Berkeley's launched a full-scale attack. This is insanity. All batteries Why is there a machine? Fire. What? He's going for my transmitters. If he takes them out, I'll never be able to launch a counterattack. Oh my god, why do I have to do this? No problem, man, but they're only toys. They're not toys. They're just smaller. With a machine gun? Oh my god, bro, you've got to be joking. That means, but all right. I don't like this. How long do I have to do this for? Oh shit! Is this legal? I feel like this is illegal. Yo, hang on a second. My aim is absolutely terrible. Let me turn this down a little. Not look sensitivity. Um, let me turn this down just a little bit. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, bitch, what the fuck? Ah! Oh my god, this is like so... What the hell? Oh my god. No! We lost the transmitter! Oh god, no. Please, no. Please, I don't want to do this again. so difficult. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Lose another transmitter. I'm not trying to make you lose transmitter, bro, but... Like, how do you expect me to aim for that? I don't know. Trying zero. Berkeley's going for the last transmitter. You've got to stop those planes, Carl. Did I do it? <laughs> oh Berkeley. my god! As long as we have opposable thumbs, we will fight you. Well done, Dude. Carl. Now yeah, leave. okay. I must prepare for the battle. This is so stupid. Don't call Never me ever again. <laughs> you owed so many. Two little three. No, that's not it. What is it? We will fight him on the beaches. Well, rooftops. Yeah. That was horrible. I hated every second of that. Oh god, do I have to keep hanging out with Zero? I don't want to! <laughs> hey, Z, where you at? Go away, Carl. I'm, I'm very, very busy back here. Top, top secret stuff, not for your eyes. Too sensitive. Come on, homie, where are you? I said go away, Carl. I don't need any friends today. Thank you. Why is he in the closet? <laughs> what? Man, nips some pretty strong draws. 
Yes, my hero. Carl, he came back and humiliated me. <laughs> I shall probably Is he getting bullied in person now, now? Or I will be found dead and broken. I am a 28-year-old man whose landlord just helped him down from a hook from which I had been hanging from my underwear, contemplating my inadequacy for nearly two hours. Ow. Damn! Oh, my crack. Look, you gotta get even, homie. What kind right. of weapons you got? Uh, I've got you need me to kill him for you? <laughs> oh, well, with that plane, we gonna go humiliate Bert. You need to kill okay, him. Cool. Don't humiliate Man, him. Kill him and then we'll leave you right alone for real. Crack. Berkeley has his sycophantic lackeys do all his deliveries. Well, we shall hit him where it hurts the most. Bring his mail order model business to its knees. All right. <laughs> Launch the Red huh? Baron. Okay. Oh, this is gonna go horribly wrong. I can already tell. How do I? Uh, wait. Oh shit! Sorry, my bad. Bro, how do I drive this thing? What the fuck is this? Don't let him get away. Punish him for his war crimes. Bro, what am I doing right now? One down, four to go. Four? Oh my god. Lieutenant, be careful, Carl. Haha, <laughs> only three delivery boys left. Okay, I guess we're going this way. This is the I'm going to whatever's the closest, I guess. Oh my god, this fucking sucks! Okay, so I took a break because that mission actually made me extremely- My eyes actually kind of still hurt from after that. I looked it up and turns out none of Zero's missions are required for me to continue the main story. So I'm just gonna skip all these missions. I reloaded all the way back to the construction mission and I, I'm not I'm not dealing with that. That is a horrible, hor whoever designed that, I don't like you. All right, we're just gonna deal with CJ stuff because I can't deal hey, with hey, that. Hi. You got it? Hey, my cousin just called me. He gave me- Another one? Car going to is this cousin nice? <laughs> she, we gotta find out who's supplying those cats. Read your mind, Holmes. I picked them up at the Maholan intersection, and I'm trailing them now. Okay, I'm coming to meet you. Better make it fast, Tom. These boys are hanging around. Ow! What if I steal a cop's motorcycle? Did somebody tell you bikes was dangerous? Bye! <laughs> I wish there was like a marker on him, but there isn't, so this is kind of difficult to follow. Oh my god, finally. Wish there was a marker here to begin with and make it my life so much more easier. Happy Holmes. All right, let's Where go, Caesar. Going? They were headed over Angel Pine Way. Follow the road and maybe we can pick them up. Angel Pine Way? Where the hell's that at? I once again, I hate that they're not giving me a marker, so it's like hard for me to like figure out where I'm going. Oh, shit. Yo, sorry, Carlos, about your car. <laughs> Alright, holy crap, dude. We made it. Wait, where on the roof am I supposed to be at? Oh, here. Face of each target and be quick to be sure to zoom in. Wait, who, who are we looking at, though? How do I know what they look like? There it is, Holmes! Oh, shit. Right. Right. Are you? This business is bigger than any gang, is it? Right. Little bitch. Yo, CJ, shut up. This guy take himself real serious. Oh my god. That's Tibo Mendez. What now? Is that it? Anyone else? Oh, there's more. Hey, who's the gringo? I don't know. I don't like the look of that guy. Who is that guy? Two thugs push the product. How it's many people are showing up? What the fuck? How many of these clowns are there? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Uh, I know a pit when I see one. 
They being clever about this. It Wait. ain't no exchange. I, I like how both of them are yelling as if no one can notice them. <laughs> that was some heavy shit. Really? We better split up and get out of here. I'll meet you back at the garage. Sorry about man. your car, Carlos. <laughs> I did that. We got what we came for anyway. Oh my god, though. I guess it makes sense now, too. Smoke can take over the game because Sweet is no longer there. <laughs> That's crazy, man. Oh, it's the Keanu Reeves guy. Hey, man, you get the flicks developed. What's up, woozy? Hey, Carl. Hi. I was just explaining to your brother-in-law that we were friends. Oh, yeah? Well, look, woozy, I need to get some info from you, man. And what exactly do you boys want to know? Who are these putas, Holmes? Why don't you go take a look? These guys? Yeah. They're the loco syndicate. They're pretty big time, I think. Don't have any dealings with them. We don't touch blow. That's good. Well, this guy <laughs> runs things. I don't know his name. This guy is T-Bone Mendez. Yeah, we know that. And who's that guy? That's Jizzy B. He's the biggest pimp in town. He helps set up the deals. You know, uh, concierge of sorts. Hmm. Hey, did he my way in? How I get to him? Oh, Jizzy? Jizzy runs the Pleasure Domes Club. <laughs> What's a name like that? <laughs> hey, good looking out, Woozy. No problem. Don't be a stranger. All right. Uh, Woozy, I hope we will stay friends and you're not going to be like, hey, you owe me because I did this for you. You know what I'm saying? I hope that's not the case. All right, let's deal with <laughs> Jizzy. <laughs> See, baby, I got oh. Make sheets. Make coats. Make curtains in the wind. When I walk down the stairs, I'm walking down on the mink car. Now, who's this trick? I don't need no more friends, baby. All they try to do is peel me from my hole. Nah, nah, it ain't about them. It's all about you, player. I heard you was the man with the hookup, and you was the man I needed to see. I'm offering my services. There are boobs on top what? of my head. <laughs> yes, sir. See, I'm new in town. Anything you want, I can do. For a guy like me to work with, to work for, a guy like Jesse B. Well, yeah, now that you mention it, I do have a slight problem. Okay. Something a little dumb muscle like yourself might be able to fix. Cause you see me, <laughs> I'm intellectual. Yeah, you definitely look <laughs> like one. Bitches, y'all walk on down to the bar and fix the pimp drink. See, I only got two eyes, and in these streets, you got to have more than that. You got to be like a flying shit, you know? A hundred eyes everywhere. Uh, yeah, now okay. Some lunatic been fucking with my bitch. My fucking killed two last week. Jesus. I want you to we'll find out. No problem. You're my player partner now, Jizzy. Yeah, and you're my way in to deal with whatever Smoke's doing. Wait up, Mr. C to the J. See that pretty young thing in my car? Stop uh. off at the hotel downtown. Use my car phone and give me a ring a ding when you're done. <laughs> okay. Hey, the rims, player? Uh, that baby like the Pope mobile. Okay, so I have to drive carefully is what you're saying. Oh, God. All right. The pimp mobile. <laughs> Later, it's saying. Okay, bye, ma'am. Hey, Jizzy, it's Carl. I just dropped off your girl. Church. Got a little errand for you to run before you deal with that problem I was just talking about. Some young buck thinks he's a player been trying to peel my holes over in Hashbury. Now, one of my girls over there just eyeballed the punk. I want you to get your ass over there and ice that pretender. Here comes my player. Now you in real trouble. I was pimping tree in months until you showed up. Okay, I can't shoot him from here. Oh, my God. No, no, not that. Not that. Not that. I don't want to blast this guy with an RPG. I'm your bitch, huh? Damn, what you got? Armor under that? Hey. It's CJ. Just to let you know, you don't have to worry about no competition in Hashbury. Worry? Did I say I was worried? No, sir. No, I did <laughs> not. Now to the real deal. Some of my girls in the Foster Valley been getting knuckled over. Okay. I want you to get your ass up there and nose around. I can Find kill him if on. you would like. I'll beat him with a shovel. Don't mind. Oh, God. I have to hurry before she dies. Oh, shit. Oh, there she is. Dick! Hey! Ain't that a surprise? I got a gun. Mr. Jizzy, it's CJ. Use a bad luck charm, Flunky! 
What? That girl you dropped off downtown wants out of the game. Her sugar daddy wants to take her off the streets. Nobody turns. How is that home. my fault? Like that's you not my problem. Back to the hotel and you oh my god. All of them. The Lord sent me to save your threadbare soul, harlot. Oh. In the car and remove your Why is it a priest, though? That so is so random. Corruption. Driver. What? Get us out of here before the devil's right hand snatches this poor girl from salvation. <laughs> what right the away, fuck? your evangelical holiness. <laughs> oh my god. All right. I mean, this is kind of easy to do if I can just... Hmm. I got an idea. I actually got an idea. If they can get to like a stop, you know, a street light. The devil comes to claim his own. Oh, here we go. Driver, Godspeed. <gasps> are they leaving? Oh, they are leaving. God damn it! I scared them. I was gonna shoot them with that. We need more than just the Lord. Oh, damn! That was fast. Don't worry, girl. The Lord's army will come to our aid. Now just keep on dressing. That's right. Put your hand there. Ew! Oh, careful, the little bishop! Oh. Be gone, foul abomination! Holy crap, I got him. Finally. <sighs> Everything's been taken care of, Mr. Jizzy. Oh, CJ, you used to play his right hand, baby. Oh, and by the way, that car's just come up over on the APB. Dump it, keep it, whatever. Just keep it away from me, my hoes, and my club. Oh, for sure, you got that, man. Oh my god, that was annoying! Hey, what's up? Hey, Carl, it's Woozy. Oh, hey. Hey, if you got some time, I'd like for you to come over so we can talk about something. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Right. I own a little betting shop in Chinatown. I hope come he's around. not a bad guy, because I actually kind of like him. <laughs> my people will be expecting a visit. It's a plan, man. Now, just listen to me, okay? Oh, it's a T-Bone guy. it's very important that you listen to me. I ain't no out of me, go. What you think? What, what, what you and Mike think? I'm just a pretty face to y'all? Is that y'all game? Mike? Is that the white guy? Now this here is the dumb muscle that I was talking about. Hey, it's me, dumb Mom, muscle. T-bone. And in reverse. Suck. Or I mean, Why is he not looking Nine at me? We go way back. Hey, hoes, don't be such a beachy liability. Liability? Liability for what? Now there's three of us and I'm getting 20%. What type of math is that? That's food math, player. You and me. I sell my soul to you guys. And that's what it's gonna come down to, huh? Screw me out of my 13%. You knew the deal. You agreed. Besides, we could have said 5%. What would and you what, what, what? Cat got your tongue? You as bad at talking as you is at mathematics? Do I have to hear this? Hey, you wanna make this shit personal, I say? Hello? Yeah. What? Damn. Hey man, I got a bounce. Oh no, you don't. I invented that trick, baby. Carl, <laughs> come with me. We're gonna have to bust us a couple of melons up in here. What do you mean the shit this has been ambushed? We can't just go out there, T Bone. It could be a DEA trap. Oh my god, that's where I come in and help you guys. God, I really. Oh, thank god, it have a marker on it. I thought there wasn't gonna be. I thought there wasn't gonna be any marker on it like the other times with Carlos. Oh, what? Ah, uh, now I have to chase bikers. Dude, why? I should I should have stuck to a car because I could run them over. Oh no, they're gonna make me use a bike. Okay, never mind. What the hell? Great. This is my favorite activity. Oh god, okay, I gotta go. How do I Oh shit, we're driving on the wrong side of the road, I just realized! Okay, okay, okay. I gotta... I got it! Bye! Alright, now I gotta...
I get the other two? I didn't know you could do that. That's actually cool. So I don't actually have to kill them. I just need to get behind it and I can snatch it. That makes it even more easier for me. The only thing is, they're on motorcycles so they can be fast and get pretty far away. And I really don't want that. Oh, wait. That's a different person, right? You're not related to this, are you? Oh my god! Why are they going the same way? Can you go freaking fight the police somewhere else? Oh, this is making it worse. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Bye, bitch! Now it's just one person. One more. Uh, here they are. Nice, okay, so I improved my bike skills too. Here they are. <laughs> Bye, asshole! <laughs> Alright, that wasn't that bad. That actually made it a lot easier that we could just snatch it off their bikes. I thought I had to kill all of them. Woo! T-Bone, pump your brakes, baby. Take a chill pig. And just lay back and let the red mist fall, brother. Hey, Holmes, open your eyes, dog. Can't you see we're getting messed with here, Holmes? Hey, partner. T-Bone, look. It's Carl. Now, he's a real hero out there. Say. See? <laughs> I'm just doing my part. Still good. <laughs> what, are you vato stupid? Someone's on to us. Yeah, it's we me. Go <laughs> I think they was just trying their luck. Mike. Mike. I've been trying to contact you. What? That's the guy we need to oh, know man. about who's Mike. Who are you? Okay, just keep talking. Hey, Holmes, Mike's in trouble. Let's bounce. What trouble? Who was Mike? Man, they taking the yay shipment and the van, and Mike's still in the back. Well, what are we gonna do? How the fuck we gonna know where he's he is? He's got his phone. He's gonna talk to us till his battery runs out. Come on, we gotta bounce. All right. I just realized something. Mike and this dude, T-Bone, was it those two people that we saw in the introduction prologue movie where they were beating that guy in in the shipment yard? Is that them? Gotta make this quick. Okay. Mike doesn't got much time oh, on his shit. battery left. He says he can hear seagulls. Five, five. Mike can hear gulls. Seagulls? Shit, that could be anywhere in this town. Right. He can hear heavy machinery. Seagulls and heavy machinery? What is that, a building site or landfill or something? There's a building site in Doherty. Oh, Doherty? Okay, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, wait, no, we can go this way. All right, I got five minutes to get there. How far is that? Wait. Oh, it's not that far. Okay. I thought it was farther. Why do they always make the, the time missions during the rain? Hey, just hang in there, Mike. Help is on the way. He says he can hear a truck reversing. He says it's busy like a freight depot or something. Freight? Oh, they must be down at the docks. What? Get to the docks in Easter Basin. Oh my god, no wonder they give us so much time because we're gonna get confused as to where he's actually at. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god, I almost hit a cop. Hey, we'll be there in a minute, Mike. Why are there so many cops around right now? Dude, what the hell? My cell phone battery's running low. I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. Shit, he says they stopped, then he heard gunfire. He thinks they just shot their way through a security gate. They don't have heavy security at the docks, but they do at the airport's freight depot. Oh my god. To the airport, rapido. Dude, oh my god, please, please be the final one, please. I'm running out of time, I got two minutes left. My near aircraft taking off and landing. Okay, okay, it has to be it. There's only one one place that can do the airport. Hey, don't worry, Mike. We're nearly there. Okay, here we go. There's the gate. And some dead security guards. Hey, this is the place. Keep your eyes peeled for that van. Okay, the tag should work now. Oh, huh? signal. There's a tag. signal. What the hell is a tag? After that last bit of trouble, Mike hid the transponder in the white. We was gonna follow it to the gang, but something must have fucked up. Okay, okay. And now we gotta use it to find the van and rescue Mike. Oh, how it work? It's not it. Simple. It's not the closer it. we get, the stronger the signal. Okay. Oh, I'm getting farther away. It's on the other side. It's on the other side. Oh my god, this is like terrifying because I only got like one minute left. My cell phone is nearly dead. Somewhere over here? 
Dude, where? I don't fucking know. Shit. There, 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 there they are. Son of a bitch. Quick, shoot him, T-Bone! Whatever your name is. Okay, I gotta help. It can't just be him. Can I not- Oh, I can't shoot? Can I not shoot? Oh, shit! <gasps> Wait, who was that one- <laughs> What happened to that guy? <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> Hey man, come on, hurry up. Put it there, put it there. About time, T Bone. Who the fuck is this? Yeah, this has to be the guy. Hey, one of Jizzy's clowns. Relax, Weddle. You hear that? We gotta torch this van with the coke in it. Hey, Charlie, Weddle, we ain't torching nada. This is a setback, but doing 20 to life is a little more than that. Comprende, amigo? Uh, yeah, hey, I kind of right, agree man. with him. Let's do it and get the hell out of here. Hey, who the fuck asked you, Payaso? This ain't a committee. Exactly. I call the shots here. Now shut up and let's go. Okay. Why are we always getting involved in these things? Oh. Do I not have a... There you go. <laughs> oh my god. Get in, get in! How do we get out of here again? Oh, fuck. Where's the exit? <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, oh, damn. Um. Fuck, I got, I got a chopper on me too! Maybe I shouldn't have used an RPG. Whew! Okay, I made it. Alright, nice. Isn't this the same color? This is the same- Okay, I'm not even gonna say anything, but whatever. It's, it's literally the same color. How long you been working for Jizzy? I haven't seen you before. Uh, just, just today? Just town last week. I've done a couple jobs here and there. Just got into town, huh? Where were you before that? Hey, what is this? Man, just answer the fucking question. Look, man, chill. I've been in Los Santos with my family, all right? Give me his wallet. Whoa! What? Hey, get off! Quit struggling and concentrate on the road. Here you go, Mike. Carl Johnson, huh? All right, I've seen enough here. Hey, it was a dub in there. Better still be there when I check it. Shut the fuck up. Excuse you! I'm kind of nervous. I'm kind of nervous though if Mike does know our name because again if Smoke and Ryder are meeting with these people they may know us too and they may tell them and we don't really want them to know that we're trying to get in here and to like figure out what's going on. Okay Carl Johnson. Why are you saying my name like that? Man now shake the spot. We got shit to talk about. Okay, guys, we're gonna end this episode here. I wanted to make it longer, but that whole deal with Zero made me have a headache, so I'm gonna stop it right here. But at least we finally got in and see what Ryder and Smoke are up to, thanks to Carlos. I'm really glad we have him. But I guess now we have to deal with knowing who Mike is, because he's definitely the leader of that little group, and then find out what Woozy wants, because he does want to talk with us. And I'm hoping he's not really a bad guy, because I kind of like him. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this episode of GTA San Andreas, remember to leave a like, please let me know in the comments what you think, and be sure to subscribe and hit the bell button for more episodes of GTA San Andreas. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye!